Hello, traders. Welcome back to my YouTube channel FX Accurate. So today, I am going to share how to trade with proper super trend with QQE mod histogram indicator. I am revealing the best strategy QQE mod histogram indicator. You ask us every day what is the trading setup setting, what should be the time frame, etc. You will definitely get the answer of all these questions in the video. Please watch the complete video. The QQE mod histogram indicator is one of the most famous trading indicators. And the reason that most traders use it is because the indicator can be utilized in various ways. It can be used as a trend indicator. Let's start the video without wasting your time. First of all let us know about trading tools. Here is the super trend which tells us about the market trend. The red color line strip is visible in the middle, we call it the zoom line. And at the bottom is our QQE mod histogram indicator. These are all our trading tools. Further we will explain the trading setup. Let's see how we use these trading tools. When the super trend changes into uptrend, the zoom line should be green color. And the QQE mod histogram should be blue color. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place by order. Our stop loss will be placed at the zoom line below. And our risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 2. The market has completely hit the target. Further we will know how to avoid false signal. Let us now understand the short position. When the super trend changes into downtrend, the zoom line should be red color. And the QQE mod histogram should be red color. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place sell order. Our stop loss will be placed at the zoom line above. And our risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 2. The market has completely hit the target. I hope you must have understood this trading strategy. If not, then it doesn't matter, we are going to see examples of some trades, so that you will definitely understand. First of all we open 1 hour chart of AUD USD. Here super trend changes into downtrend. The zoom line is red color. And the QQE mod histogram is also red color. So all our conditions are being fulfilled so we are place order to sell. Our stop loss will be placed at the zoom line above. And our risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 2. Let's see what happens to our trade. Our trade is running in profit. We have won the trade. Let's find the next trade. We have got the signal. Here super trend changes into uptrend. The zoom line is green color. And the QQE mod histogram is blue color. So all our conditions are being fulfilled, so we are place ordered to buy. Our stop loss will be placed at the zoom line below. And our risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 2. Let's see what happens to our trade. Our trade is running in profit. We have won the trade. Let's find the next trade.
We have got the signal. Here super trend changes into downtrend. The zoom line is red color. And the QQE and mod histogram is also red color. So all our conditions are being fulfilled, so we are place order to sell. Our stop loss will be placed at the zoom line above. And our risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 2. Let's see what happens to our trade. Our trade is running in profit. We have won the trade. Let's find the next trade. We have got the signal. Here super trend changes into uptrend. The zoom line is green color. And the QQE mod histogram is blue color. So all our conditions are being fulfilled, so we are place ordered to buy. Our stop loss will be placed at the zoom line below. And our risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 2. Let's see what happens to our trade. Our trade is running in profit. We have lost this trade. Never mind, sometimes it happens in the market. We must remember one thing that no strategy works 100% in the market. Let's find the next trade. We have got the signal. Here super trend changes into downtrend. The zoom line is red color. And the QQE mod histogram is also red color. So all our conditions are being fulfilled, so we are place order to sell. Our stop loss will be placed at the zoom line above. And our risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 2. Let's see what happens to our trade. Our trade is running in profit. We have won the trade. Let's find the next trade. Here zoom line is red color and market is in uptrend so we will not take any trade here. The zoom line will only take one trade once it is changed so we will not take any trades here. Let's find the next trade. Here super trend changes into uptrend. The zoom line is green color. And the QQE mod histogram is blue color. So all our conditions are being fulfilled, so we are place ordered to buy. Our stop loss will be placed at the zoom line below. And our risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 2. Let's see what happens to our trade. Our trade is running in profit. We have won the trade. Let's find the next trade. We have got the signal. Here super trend changes into downtrend. The zoom line is red color. And the QQE mod histogram is also red color. So all our conditions are being fulfilled, so we are place order to sell. Our stop loss will be placed at the zoom line above. And our risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 2. Let's see what happens to our trade. Our trade is running in profit. We have won the trade. Let's find the next trade. We have got the signal. Here super trend changes into uptrend. 
The zoom line is green color. And the QQE mod histogram is blue color. So all our conditions are being fulfilled, so we are place ordered to buy. Our stop loss will be placed at the Zoom line below. And our risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 2. Let's see what happens to our trade. Our trade is running in profit. We have won the trade. I hope you must have liked this trading strategy. Now let's see how we made our setup. First of all, we have to search Super Trend in the search box of Trading View. And click on Super Trend option. In which we have to change some setting. We have to replace ATR period 10 with 9 and ATR multiplier 3 with 3.9. After that we will apply another indicator on the chart. We have to search QQE mod in the search box of trading view. And click on QQE mod option. In which we have to change some setting. We have to hide QQE line. After that we will apply another indicator on the chart. We have to search Zoom in the search box of Trading View. And click on Trend Indicator AV2. In which we have to change some setting. We have to replace EMA length 14 with 52 and EMA length smoothing 14 in place of 10. I hope you must have liked this trading strategy. This strategy should be used in most major currency pairs. If you get to learn something new on our channel, then do subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you for watching our video. See you in the next video.